Hello from Myrtle Beach. Today we are going to bring to you a lot of exciting news about both new and also newly renovated attractions here at Myrtle Beach in 2023 and also some other news. There's just a lot of news. These are updates to our more recent videos. I'll link those in the description below so you can check those out too because we're not going to cover everything again. We are just going to give you some updates and also some new announcements beyond those. First, let's stop here at Ripley's Aquarium. We're gonna pop inside and show you some of the new exciting stuff coming here. First of all, there is gonna be a new Discovery Center. It's gonna be in the central hub here at Ripley's Aquarium, and it's gonna be a hands-on exhibit with other things as well. Additionally, they are going to have a sloth exhibit. I know we talked to you about this in one of our other videos, but that is the new news. It is official now. They are going to have a sloth exhibit and according to the person I spoke to, they are going to have it opening in April. Uh, the news says late April uh, or late spring, but according to their staff inside, they do have an opening coming in April. Also, they now have cheddar on public display. Cheddar is a very rare one in 30 million chance orange lobster. It was found by Red Lobster in Florida and they shipped it to Ripley's and so it's on display here at Ripley's Aquarium. You can now see it, it's open to the public. They had him behind the scenes for a while but now he is out where you can see him in the public. Also their most recent exhibit that's already open, it's not super new, it's been here a bit, but is the penguin exhibit. They have live feedings, they're adorable, they swim around, I mean it's definitely fun for the whole family so be sure and check that out. Now that we're here at Broadway at the beach, we are gonna move on and show you some of the new attractions that are gonna be opening on Ocean Boulevard near the boardwalk area. So come along with us. If you're new to our channel, hi, I'm Carmen. We cover everything Myrtle Beach and the surrounding area. And if you're a return viewer, thanks so much for watching. Now let's head down to the boardwalk area. We're now down to Ocean Boulevard. We're gonna cover all of the exciting news about the other Ripley's attractions that are down here at Ocean Boulevard. First of all, the Mirror Maze, which is right here in front of me, it's this red building. They are expanding it quite a bit from what it is right now. And I even hear construction noise in the background. They've got all kinds of stuff going on. So that is gonna get expanded. Up next is the Haunted Adventure. The Haunted Adventure is gonna be rethemed. So you can see they've got some sort of construction barriers up here. It is gonna be rethemed to be a 1908 murder mystery don't have a lot more details than that so I don't know if you're actually trying to actively solve a mystery while you're inside or if it's just rethemed to be that type of a haunted adventure so that's pretty exciting as well and they have taken their sign down but right here they had a sign they are going to have a indoor putt-putt course it is we don't know exactly what it's gonna be like it sounds like it's gonna be pretty unique it's gonna be somewhere in this area and they said it would even have a bar inside. So it sounds like it's gonna be a pretty cool venue. So that's coming. And then also the 5D theater is being converted into the Ripley's Illusion Lab. So here's a poster for it. It is going to be basically mind boggling challenges, things like that. Um, it sounds pretty interesting. So we'll definitely be checking that out. And also let's take a walk. I wanna tell you a few more things about all of this. Um, also, if you're not aware, Ripley's has tickets you can buy that will get you into all Ripley's attractions. So I think they call it the Ultimate Pass, but definitely check their website. And so once all these open, and we'll keep you posted, so be sure and subscribe and you won't miss anything about what's about to open. We will definitely let you know when those open. Once they're all open, that would actually be a really good value because you would get... I, I checked with them at the aquarium and they said it will include everything. Uh, so it would include all these new attractions, everything you see here, the aquarium, as well as the Ripley's Auditorium, which is also here on Ocean Boulevard. Also got news about Family Kingdom and specifically the Swamp Fox. It is a classic wooden roller coaster, a lot of fun. Brian has ridden this. He says it's fantastic and you can see the ocean. But as you can see, they are replacing like large parts of it, pretty much the whole track from what we've seen so far. 
uh, doing a complete renovation. The uh, Family Kingdom is one of the few places that does have an off season where they close down for a bit and this is why. It's so they can renovate their attractions. They're also working on other parts of the park. So this is going to be something that once you come during tourist season should be back open again. They plan to open in the spring and everything hopefully will be open by that point. But it's pretty cool to see them working on this classic wooden coaster and giving it the love it deserves. If you've enjoyed this video be sure to click on the video on your screen right now and click subscribe so you won't miss anything new. Thanks so much for watching until our next adventure!